Si fueras a escribirle a un amigo dice, te escuché esto y suena, ¿qué, ¿qué dirías? ¿Cómo dirías que suena? ¿Cómo lo pondrías en palabras? Sí, en español. Un acorde muy grande. No, 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 I mean, more than that, no, no chord. I mean, what, what sounds? It sounds like rain on a roof. Like rain on a roof. Piensa por qué. Okay, well let's say it let's say it sounds like raining on the roof. Okay. Okay, so you take that phrase in Espanol, it's raining on my roof. Vamos a tomar esa frase. Está lloviendo en el tejado. Now you play and you sing that. You sing, play this chord, I'll show you. Find 
one note that sounds good. saying it wouldn't matter because you wouldn't care because I was just going to go and go and go and it was matter and it doesn't matter. You see? I speak like this. Es importante. Si te pones, si estás hablando con Verónico media hora sin hacer pausas, no importa lo que esté diciendo, no vas a poner atención al significado. Eh, es importante hablar pausado. So play, play this chord. Wonderful, gotta go. You wanna try another round? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You go like this, yeah. You go like And you have to have the patience to go back and do the hard things. The things you don't necessarily want to do. Because those will help you in your overall goal on the internet. Que eso, esas cosas les van a ayudar para alcanzar su meta última con el instrumento. You're all very 
you have wonderful potential and I, I wish you guys the best in the team. Te entregamos el chat a ustedes les deseo la mejor de las suertes. Que es el jurado, Julio Rubén. Tantito, porque no tiene mucho. La bandera de México y el monumento de la revolución. Ya, apriétale.